wanted to let you know that you are a finalist for the Claudette Scott Teacher of the Year. Congratulations. Wow. Thank you. Miss White has been a constant example of teaching excellence at Truman for the past four years. She exemplifies a master teacher with her innovation, detailed planning, and use of high yield strategies. The library is the heart of the school because of the love and dedication of Miss White. She's definitely an asset to Truman and she yeah. has helped us to move on the continuum. She totally believes in the mission and vision and everything we're trying to accomplish. So I'm like verklempt. I'm like, oh, I'm so <laughs> proud of her. I find myself very blessed to be at Hickman Mills, especially at Truman. I feel like I'm working with my family every day. Um, we really have an incredible relationship at Truman. It's just really important to make sure that our students are engaged and having fun. And I think that that's kind of um, one of the lucky things I get to do as the media specialist is I really get to challenge them and bring in those really fun, engaging 21st century pieces. So along with the technology, you know, it's. I get to know our students, I get to know what they want to do, and I every week think about what I want to do that's really going to hook them or engage them. And uh, I really uh, take my relationships with the students into account every single day when I plan what we want to do. They, they pass me notes in the hallway that say, can we go into the steam room tomorrow? You know, so I, uh, I really enjoy, enjoy what I do and um, I have fun with it as well. I actually invited you to the Zoom meeting to let you know that you are a finalist for the Claudette Scott District Teacher of the Year. Congratulations. Yay. Yay. <laughs> Rachel has worked tirelessly in advocating for all Ruskin students. Rachel teaches her students to navigate the complexities of adult life while instilling in them the pride of who they are as students of Ruskin High School. Job well done, keep up the good work, and uh, good luck, and go, go bring the ban bring the banner home, Miss May. Bring the banner back home. <laughs> the miracles she works in her classroom every day are just unrealized. She has created such a loving environment. She is literally the heart of Ruskin High School. She can navigate the waters of the special education world with ease, and helps all the administrators, not just me, with things that we have questions about and things that we're not familiar with. When I go into Rachel's room, all I see is happiness. The kids are working at the skill level that they need to work at and she gets them higher. And you can tell that there's just joy and love in that room always. Wonderful. I love all my students. I get to keep them for many years. Some of them I've had for seven years now. And it's really hard not to be able to see them. A lot of my kids, I continue to see them even after they're done. Uh, their parents stay in contact with me. But this year, doing this transition class, I've seen more growth. But just to see them come to me and shy, quiet, you know, their social skills and throughout the year seeing their growth and talking to the parents and the parents being like, yes, I see this. And it's not just me, but it's my classroom, their friends, the other students, my parents. I mean, everybody contributes to their growth. This meeting is to tell you that you are a finalist for the Claudette Scott District Teacher of the Year. Oh, Congratulations. Yeah. Thank you. <laughs> Ms. Tolls holds a belief that all her students can learn high, at high levels. That belief impacts all of Ingalls, not just her classroom. And you have just had not only care, but such a level of professionalism. Everybody should just know that just doesn't see you as often as I do is just how amazing you are. <laughs> oh, oh, yes, <laughs> Are you proud of your mom? <laughs> yes. Yes. <laughs> Well, I am a fifth grade teacher at Ingalls Elementary School. Um, I have been at Ingalls for 22 years. Now I'm getting the kids, like the kids of the students I had my first couple of years teaching. 
I'm teaching their kids now. And so that, you know, they know me as a teacher and the fact that they just trust me with their kids and um, they'll just, they'll just say, Ms. Tolls, I know you do whatever you need to do because I know you're going to do the right thing. You're going to do what's, what's right for my child. And to have that kind of trust, you know, your child is everything to you. You know, when I, it wasn't until I had my own that I'm like, oh, this is really a big responsibility. So um, your child is everything to you. And so to entrust your greatest gift to someone else is huge. So that's like the best thing for me.